I took a Nighthawk Gliders Tornado and modified it to use an 8520 motor and a capacitor power. I uh, changed the engine location, set it closer to the main wing to provide the same center of gravity as the original glider, and used clay to adjust as necessary. The tail was modified to a standard vertical and horizontal stabilizer to allow easier trimming to the compensate for motor ta torque. And uh, I used existing wing tabs to compensate for motor torque during the initial fast motor speeds as the glider climbs after launch. The charger contacts are pushed against the capacitor leads to transfer battery power into the capacitor. The leads of the motor uh, are at the base of the uh, leads of the capacitor. With the 3 by 1.2 volt rechargeable NICAD batteries that I use in the battery box that I got from a kid's capacitor plane, it takes about 7 to 30 seconds to put a full charge on the capacitors when the batteries are fully charged. So let's go fly this thing. Thank you.